Okay guys, so we're just about to go for a road trip to the Monkey Mountain. I'll roll the shot so you can see the drive there. So we've just been driving for about 20 minutes and we just had to stop because look at these views, they're like ridiculous. Like wow, such nice weather today, we're so lucky. Because it's actually rainy season here so we definitely had to go for a road trip today. We haven't seen any monkeys yet on the mountains but the views here are like ridiculous. <laughs> the Lady Buddha and this temple that's over there and there's like um, so many tourists here mostly like Chinese tourists but you, we just saw like three big tour buses just come in so there's like heaps of people here which is so crazy because we just went from like over there where there's like no people and then there's like so many people here oh and there's some jackfruit there just next to the temple so we just finished coming out of the Monkey Mountains and we're feeling really hungry so we just pulled up at this restaurant right here and um, it's like completely dead, there's like no one here at all. We're literally the only customers. They were sleeping. And yeah, they, they, were, they were actually sleeping, there was like two men but they were sleeping when we got here. So I was like, hello, hello, like food, food, can we eat, can we eat? And then he was like, translated something weird in Vietnamese and I just was like, oh, okay. So I pointed at the noodles and I pointed at like some I pointed at some orange juice and then, so I don't really know what I'm getting. I'm guessing I'm getting orange juice and noodles. And then we ordered a, one beer and then they come out with like freaking like five beers. So I don't know, <laughs> lost in translation, but um, we'll see what we'll be getting. Should be a surprise. So I don't really know what I'm eating, but um, it's like some kind of seafood. So I'll just give it a go. <laughs> It's like not that bad really. It tastes okay. It just tastes like fish. It's good. Carlos ordered like some random thing off the menu as well, but it's like, it looks like porridge. And then it's got like the same kind of fish that mine's got. And he put like chili sauce in it, so I don't know. It, his one tastes okay as well, but I like mine because it's got the noodles. I like all of it. I like vermicelli noodles, so that's good. Hmm. But overall they're pretty good. They're like not too bad, really. So over there there's like people, these little things on the water, there's actually houses. People live in these little tin houses on the water they're fishermen because there's a fishing boat so they live right on the water it's pretty cool you got the Vietnamese flag cute there's such a gorgeous mountain right there as well it's so pretty Super nice. This looks like we're in America. San Francisco. San Fran. Oh my god, we're in Paris. No, we're just in Vietnam, guys. So we just got back home and that was such an eventful day like I can't believe like the monkey mountains were that beautiful and that we saw a bridge that kind of looked like San Francisco so that was really weird but also really cool. And I also found out after we finished eating lunch that the little Vietnamese guy that was serving us he actually translated which was really cute of him. He translated that the soup that we had was eel so I had eel noodle soup and Carlos had eel congee. <laughs> So I've never tried eel before so that was really interesting but it actually didn't taste that bad so I was really quite surprised. But yeah, um, thanks for watching guys and I'll catch you on my next vlog. Bye!